Ready to listen to the elemental fairy's tale? Click on play and join the fun with Alex and Lily. Hey, Lily! Rain doesn't mean we can't have fun. <laughs> hmm, I think I have an idea. Since it's raining, how about we play and make up a story about the elements? <laughs> Great! Our tale's title will be The Fairies of the Elements Kingdom. Let's get to it! Once upon a time, the world was divided into four kingdoms. The kingdoms of water, wind, earth, and the kingdom of fire, the most dreaded of them all. The kingdom of water was ruled by the sea fairy. She was kind and generous with the other kingdoms, even though she didn't allow them to cross over to her kingdom. Her mission was to provide water to all the kingdoms, no matter the situation. And so far, she had never broken her promise. But one day, the water fairy got a letter from the Wind Kingdom. In it, the Cloud Fairy told her she had heard some rumors. Birds were saying the Fire Fairy wanted to conquer the whole world. The Water Fairy answered back through the rain. I'll build ice walls so the fire can't pass through them. The Wind Fairy decided then she'd visit the Earth Fairy to let her know what was going on. The Earth Fairy was really responsible, so she'd understand the situation. But when she knocked on her tree door, it turned out the Earth Fairy was sick. Fire had overtaken her kingdom, suffocating it with smoke, and her decision was putting up mountains to stop it and bury it. The Wind Fairy had no choice but to go visit the Fire Kingdom's castle. <laughs> that was the most dreaded place in the whole world. But the wind could make it anywhere. And after going past the biggest volcanoes, she snuck in through the window of the Fire Fairy's bedroom. But what she found there was not what she had expected. The Fire Fairy was sad. She had burned a flower without meaning to, and the wind had taken it before she could say goodbye. The Wind Fairy understood what was happening. Her tears were made of fire, and that's why the Earth was burning down. She didn't want to invade it. She just couldn't handle her sadness. And that's how the wind asked the Sea Fairy to give the Fire Fairy some water tears. And that's how the Earth Fairy could breathe again. <laughs> you became the fairy of all the elements. <laughs> now you're in charge of keeping the balance in the world. <laughs> Kira, today is a perfect day to enjoy the beach. Wow, that's really bad luck, a summer storm. We'd better run back home. Wow, you've gotten really wet and you don't like that at all. <laughs> Luckily, you are all dry now, though it is a shame we can't spend all day sunbathing. I wish we had powers to fix that. Such a good idea, Kira. We can play and dress you up as a magic fairy. Maybe that way you can change the weather and make it sunny again. Let's see what we've got in the closet. Ooh, such a beautiful dress. First, we need to put your skirt on. And now, the top. I'm sure it'll look great. Hmm, but in order to get your fairy necklace, we are going to need to get rid of yours. Done! It looks great! 
Let's see what else we've got here. So cool! A hairband and rainbow wings. That means you'll be the rainbow fairy. And you'll be able to fly with those wings so you can make the clouds disappear and fill summer with sunshine. Wow! That's really cool! You look like a real fairy now! Shall we go to the beach and try out your powers? Come on, Fairy Kira! If you focus, I'm sure you can use your powers! Wow, Kira! You made it! Your rainbow fairy powers have worked! You can go sunbathing again! Though, I'm afraid we'll have to put the swimsuit on again so you don't get too hot. <laughs> wow! You are the most incredible fairy in the world! Hi, Lily! Awesome! You have such a cool glitter jar! It reminds me of the day you turned into the Tooth Fairy! <laughs> no wonder you like becoming a fairy! They have powers and they are beautiful, like you. <laughs> I have an idea. If you want, we can play and turn you into the Toon Toon Fairy. And choose what power you'll have while I tell you things about those amazing magical creatures. Let's get to it, Lily. Wow, these clothes are so cool. Fairies are magical beings that protect nature. And they love dancing with shoes like these. <laughs> Whoa, and those cute bows? I think they go on your legs. Yes! You look great with them. <laughs> Did you know fairies can live for more than 500 years? Look! Can you guess what all this is for? We'll dye and do your hair with it. It's going to be beautiful. But before that, we need to take your ponytails down. Now, with your hair down, it's going to be easier to change your hairstyle. Now, let's color your hair red. The color of passion. Because love makes fairies happy. You look really good. You should wear this color more often. <laughs> fairies' hair is usually very long. So, let's stretch it out a bit. <laughs> and their bangs usually have lots of volume. Wow, you look great with your hair like this, Lily. Yay! But, in order to give your look a magical touch, let's put some glitter on your hair. <laughs> <laughs> now you do look like a fairy. Yay! Do you know what's the favorite hobby of these magical creatures? playing music in the forests, where they live, especially the flute. Here are the accessories, Lily. With these wings, you'll be able to fly and perch on the flowers. <laughs> They're so cool. Whoa, this hairband has a diamond. And it's really shiny. Super. I just need to give you your magic wand. Do you want to cast your first spell? <laughs> awesome! Your fairy power is great! And you're all so shiny! So cool! Now you are the Toon Toon Fairy! Hi, girls! You're not ready for the rainbow party yet? I think Kira is not happy about the result. <laughs> Don't worry, Kira. I have an amazing surprise today. The Toon Toon Magic Combs. Only combing a lock of hair will change its color. That way, we won't take as long to get you ready for the party. <laughs> ready? <laughs> I see. You've already started with your hair. Wow, you look incredible. But now we're going to give it a final touch with our magic combs. 
since it is a rainbow-themed party, we'll use the six combs we've got! <laughs> also, since your hair is pink, we'll be able to get all the colors of the rainbow in your head! You look great, Lily! You are beautiful! Time to dress up now! That black leotard will make your hair stand out! And with this skirt, everyone will know what party you are going to! Last but not least, with these shoes, you'll be able to dance for as long as you want! You are ready, Lily! Wow, Kira! You've taken this seriously! <laughs> but let's give that hair the final touch with our magic combs! First, we'll make some red, orange, and yellow locks! The warm colors of the rainbow! And now we'll use green, blue, and purple! So we have all the colors we need! Done! Time for your clothes! This leotard will be very comfy! And this skirt will match Lily's! <laughs> Last but not least, let's put on these cute shoes! You are beautiful, Kira! Girls, you look wonderful! You'll be the center of attention at the Toon Toon Rainbow Party! If you had fun with this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to our channel! And join our great Toon Toon Games family!